Hey, I just wanted to do a quick video update. Um, this is where we come every Tuesday and Thursday and play pickup soccer. It's a really sweet court that um, was built here. And uh, afterwards we go to tutoring. Um, so it's just a weekly habit we have. Um, thank you guys all for helping support us to be able to do this. This is my buddy, Asuk. Asuk, what's your, uh, how long have you been involved with Urban Eagle? Five years, I think. Five years? Oh my gosh. What are you, how old are you now? Fourteen. Forty? Fourteen. Oh, fourteen, fourteen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's your favorite part about Urban Eagle? I know, like getting guys to hang out with each other, have fun, talk about Jesus. Yeah. What's the, what's one of the things you've learned from Urban Eagle? How to love each other. Wow, that's cool. That's he is love and we have found our peace. Our King has come. And he Our desire is to build on our last 30 years of experience by creating training programs to prepare players through a season of training for a lifetime of service. With the Eagles, it's just an amazing environment because you are playing at a really high level and it's cutthroat, it's hard, it's competition, but you're challenged to live out your faith in that environment. Yeah, especially we start uh, the first three months of each year we do sports ministry training. I feel like those are just incredible sessions to just equip you for using sports, uh, especially soccer, to spread the gospel. We're training our men to, to take their faith and put it on the field, that's through transformation. Why are you on the field? Why do you step on the field? Is it to win a game and compete, or is it truly to glorify the Lord? Our ministry is the way we play soccer. So you got 25 of some of the most competitive people I've ever met in my life. Um, we're like a family that we got one goal, and that is to love the Father and serve the Father with all we got. The Urban Eagles was one of the first ministries that went to a place and just stayed there and put roots down deep, just lived in a place. Sports ministry brought us into the neighborhood. We were using soccer to build relationships with the kids. Play soccer for an hour, hour and a half, and then sit down with kids and just tell them how much God loved them. God had a plan for their life. I mean, the whole community is being changed. Being at camp with kids, I felt more alive than I've ever felt. Working with kids just kind of opens your mind up to the idea of coaching, which over the years has really kind of snowballed for me into something that I have a great passion for as well. One of the kids in my group I said to Jesus Christ, so that was really special. It showed me that, that God has a plan for all of us and he's, uh, he's got a purpose for me, for me being here. So youth tours are basically a collection of a boys team and a girls team, and then we take them down for two weeks in Brazil and we get to allow them to actually do sports ministry and try it out and be involved in that. We were in a city and we went to the local football court and because we were Americans we drew a huge crowd and because we drew a huge crowd we had a big crowd to hear the gospel. God has really done a transforming work in my heart and it's come through a lot of different experiences that I've had here in Charlotte. It's just amazing, it's remarkable the difference now being trained like I want to do it. I know I've been called to do it. I know I can go overseas. I'm capable. We definitely wouldn't be able to be here in Charlotte doing inner city ministry with the Urban Eagles if we hadn't had the training. We, we felt really believed in, like that anything was possible. And that's what this organization is about, is impacting people so that they can take what they learn here and how they grow here back in their daily lives and change lives wherever they are. That's Jesus' model empower a few and they go and they transform a few more and it grows exponentially. MAI and the Charlotte Eagles have been able to offer a message of hope through sports to the youth around the world.